Hey guys, it's Rich. Hey guys, it's Rich. With today we're gonna share a real brief. Iowa Province. Man, broke my signage. Three today. Bringing you another. Guys, thanks for watching this too. Oh. It's a Tuesday night and it's so slow out here. So make it fast. You gotta have your A game on slower nights. You really do. X Classic, you gotta have your A game every night, okay? It's just, there, there's nothing, nothing else to say about that, man. If you're, you're not rolling and moving and getting folks to places that help them find the fun and take care of you a little, you're not gonna make a lot of money doing this, man. I, I, I've been doing this three and a half years. You gotta find the fun for folks. You gotta make the recos. You gotta stay positive and have fun with it while you're out here. You know, if you wanna watch bullshit and drivers getting in altercations and egging people on and, you know, getting their puked on or whatever, you turn to that Dustin guy's channel. He's got like 100,000 people, drivers who love misery and don't like making money, saving money, or staying positive out here and finding your next step in life. This, this is just something to do in Uber and Lyft's defense. They never told drivers, quit your day job, come work for us. Drivers who did that, did that on their own volition, okay? And if you went out and dropped 50 grand on a car and you're making 50 grand a year, that's on you. You gotta find ways to make it happen. Um, I personally would never recommend spending more than 15 grand on a vehicle to do this. There's great used vans you can get for that price if you wanna do the XL game. Um, I, I get asked all the time, dude, why don't you do XL? You'd kill it. I like um, the crowd control. I like you know, the three people in my car. Uh, we know what happens when you get more people. You got more messes. That's not really it though, but you also get more people and more decision makers happening. It's easier to sway a smaller group and make a recommendation to them. But back to what to do when it's slow. All markets are different. Um, there's apps out there that give you some activity. Of course, Uber and Lyft, they of course drive here for more requests in almost all instances, they're telling you to drive to what, um, what Uber and Lyft like to uh, refer to as underserved communities. Translation drivers, dangerous as fuck neighborhoods. That's where they want you to go to get rides, okay? So you gotta use your head. It's not worth it, in my opinion. Find some places. I'm hanging outside Wahoo's right now, fish taco waiting on my buddy, Corey. We're gonna grab a bite. By the way, Wahoo's is awesome. Um, if you haven't dined here, they have I think they have four or five locations in the Valley. Um, pull up kickback app, go under restaurants, you get 20% off as a driver, just flash it to them. I don't even have to because they know me because I come in here at least three times a month. And it's like, you know, 10 bucks, you get some awesome food, awesome Cajun beans, rice, their sides, their salsas are awesome. But find these spots and develop some habits. What is that reflection? It looks like I got an eye patch, like, Kramer on Seinfeld in the Scofflaw episode. Boy, I just dated myself there. People are going, what the hell is Seinfeld? But you gotta stay positive with these folks. Um, perfect example, Tuesday night, I decided to come out and drive. I thought I'd have to do jury duty tomorrow. I called in though, found out, you've been excused, so hooray. But I'm gonna stay out, cause I'm out here. And yeah, it's it's been, um, uh, I wouldn't say it's been slow, but it's just been you know shitty ride after ride. And I haven't had any um, any cash tips in eight rides, which is typically unheard of. Like I said, I like showing the cash, getting it up in front of them, and uh, letting them know this is how I work. I mean, my first ride today, he did tip five in the app. He said, well, just so you know, this is our first Uber ride ever. And I turned around, I said, that's great. When we get to your destination, I'm gonna show you how to custom tip in the app. And his wife started laughing. He sort of did a tongue in cheek, oh, okay. Anyway, um, you got to have fun with it. And th this thing is so important too. I'm, I know I'm going in a few different directions here, but this, this new Lyft deal where they can only tip for 24 hours and Lyft sold it to all of us in this bill of goods that, no, it, it means they can't rate after 24 hours, which is good for you drivers. Dude, dudes, dames, they did this to save money on processing fees, all right? I mean, I get used to get a lot of tips a couple years ago in Lyft. 
in the app. Now we all know it's the low price leader. They're the Walmart or rideshare. They're basically the city bus transportation. Again, it may differ in your market, but on Classic in, in my market, they are always, their minimum fare is 868, Ubers is 907. That may seem like pennies, but psychologically you're, you're stepping up to another dollar level there. And they're the price shoppers. They shop the apps. Uh, typically, I've found here, Uber riders, and I'm not an apologist for either one of these companies. They could both do better. Anyway, my boy Corey just rolled up. We're gonna go grab some Wahoos. Come by and join me. Even if you're in Cleveland, fly over. We'll be here at least 45 minutes and get out there, stay positive, be funny, make money.